In the book of Ecclesiastes in the Bible, we read there is a time for everything and a season for everything under the heavens. Hi, John Stanley here. We're so pleased that you've dropped by um, this afternoon, and it's good to, to be with you. In the book of Ecclesiastes, we read that there is a time for everything. And the writer continues, God has made everything beautiful in its own time, in its own time, a time for everything. And God has made everything beautiful in his own time. Clearly, it is not our timing, but it's God's timing. And that's hard. That's hard for us. Uh, you know, I ran, ran across this the other day, and I thought, maybe you would like to see it as well. Stress or faith? Stress. Stress makes us believe that everything needs to happen right now. Stress needs to happen right this moment. However, when we have faith, faith assures us that everything will happen at the right time in God's own timing. So we have a choice. Do we operate under stress or faith? Stress says we need to happen right now, this red hot moment. Faith says God is working everything out in God's own timing. Stress or faith? Since March of this year, We've been in very unusual times, going on about seven months, and many of us have grown very impatient. When are we going to get back to normal, we ask. When will we be back to normal? But then we read in the Bible, in the book Second Peter, the Lord is not slow in keeping his promise as some understand slowliness. We seem to believe that God is working things out so slowly, and we want him to hurry up and make it right. So the Lord is not slow in keeping his promise, as some understand slowliness. Someone has said that God does answer our prayers all the time. Yes, no, or wait. Yes, no, or wait. And it is the waiting that we cannot stand, right? But we remember that stress makes us believe that everything needs to happen right now. But faith, faith assures us that everything will happen at the right time and at the perfect time, and that's God's timing. Certainly, our timing is definitely not God's timing. In the 90th Psalm, Psalm 90, the psalmist writes, A thousand years in your sight are like a day that has just gone by. A thousand years in God's sight is like one day in our sight. Let us please remember we can operate by stress, or we can operate by faith. Stress says we want to happen right now. Faith says we allow God's timing. It's not our timing. A thousand years to us is just one day in God's sight. Thank you for this time together, and we sure hope that God continues to hold you in the palm of his hand until we can be together again. God bless. Thank you.